Hey, you guys. Um, today, I'm here to talk about the Braxton Family Value Season 4, Episode 11. Um, I was like, damn, it's still in the same season, but okay, we can work with it. Um, it starts off with Tracy um, at the radio station. You know, last time she was talking about how she was going to be on the radio or whatever. So now we get to see her on the radio, and she's happy that she's on a national radio show. I don't know which one, but okay. I wasn't mad at her shit. Somebody, everybody got to start somewhere. But she was getting irritated about people asking her with drama about her sisters. And I get it. I get it. You know, but I'm like, y'all put y'all business out there so people want to know. I'm sorry. People really want to know because y'all love people hanging um, and stuff like that. But I do get it. Like, you keep saying the same old story. You know what I'm saying? So you, you, you probably get tired of talking about the same old thing. I get that part. Um, but yeah, so that was with that. Um, I'm going to try to go by everything, but I don't know how that's going to work out. <laughs> um, I don't even want to go by everything. Let's just talk about what happened on this episode. So I'll keep on going with Trina. So, um, Trina, yeah, we'll just do that. We'll talk about these systems. Trina, um, not Trina, Tracy. Tracy, now, I like how they involve in her family. They involve in her husband and they involve in her son. I like that. I think that's cool. But she was tripping off of him because she wanted to cook breakfast or whatever. And he said that he was getting ready to go with his girlfriend. So she kind of got offended or whatever and talking about he's always with her. But I'm like, he's young. He got that teenage club. You know how I go. I got an 18-year-old, so I get it. Um, they always together. Well, not all. Yeah, they always together. Every time they got free time, they together. So, I get it. But I think I'm the type of person, I like to put myself in their shoes on how I was when I was their age. So, I try not to overreact. So, to me, I think I get what Tracy is coming from. But a lot of it, I think she's overreacting. It's not like he just got with the girl. They've been together three years. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Um, we find out he's taking a year off from school because he told Tamar he wanted to be an entrepreneur. So, you know, she encouraged him to take the first year off. So that's what he did. Tracy didn't know nothing about it, but we're getting that. Um, but, you know, he just... He in love with his girlfriend, and she's that type of mama. She not feeling that because she young, and she don't want him to put her, all his eggs in one basket being so damn young. But I'm like, everything is a life lesson. You know what I'm saying? You you can't say that they're not going to be together 10, 20 years from now. You know what I'm saying? Unless, hey, she, some, she sees something we don't see or whatever because we you know, we don't know the girl, so maybe she sees something different. But the way that everybody else was talking about it, like they liked her, so I don't know. Um, and then at the end of the episode, he sits them down, he take them to dinner or whatever, so she cool with that. So she tells them about her what she know about what her family and with that he tells her that he proposed to well, he asked, um, her father, the girlfriend's father, for her hand in marriage or whatever, for his blessings or whatever, and it was to be continued because they couldn't believe that. The mom and daddy couldn't believe that. But I'm like, it's young teenage love. We all been there. So I really couldn't go in on him. Um, and I don't know their relationship. Um, now let's get on to Tracy. I mean, Trina. Trina. Now this season, I mean the rest of this season, wants to divorce Gabe now. Last season they was all getting along. She was tripping about him being so much in her business, but all of a sudden they get a divorce. She's fed up. Is she for real this time? And I was cracking up when they was doing the replays of how they was getting back together, breaking up, getting back together. Because I'm like, we all have heard this before. But okay. So now she's saying she really, really is going to divorce him. Her her and Tawanda was going shopping or whatever for some stuff, for another business she's trying to open. And she ended up telling Tawanda about um, her 
you know, her and her husband or whatever. But she don't tell the whole story. That's why I can't get invested in this. Um, my thing is, did he hit her? Because that's the only thing I can think about, dude. You know what I'm saying? Did he threaten to kill her? I mean, you know, shit like that. Because we all know he has cheated. We <laughs> all know he's spending and he won't give her no money. So she's saying it's worse or whatever. I'm like, what could he have done besides hit you? Because that's the only thing I know of that could be worse or he molested the kids that you know of. I don't know. You can't say, oh, he cheated with a friend, because I'm like, we know he a dog-ass dude. So that wouldn't surprise nobody. Um, Then she tells Tawanda, don't tell nobody. I'm sitting there like, you know who you told? Then they start talking about the whole um separation, you know, because they had Tamar with her mom, and then they had the girls talking, too. But they were basically talking about the same thing, so I'm going to get it all out the way of how the whole thing went down when Ed's the sisters got on stage with Tamar and she didn't know and how to, you know, backstage school tour manager put them out or whatever. And Tamar explained that she wanted the camera crew to leave and he told everybody to leave, but it was his, excuse me, it was his bad. So he ended up apologizing to Trina when he saw her at another concert, he ended up apologizing, and she was happy that he apologized. But they don't think that Tamar would ever apologize. And I'm like, okay, well, if y'all don't think she apologizes, this is a waste of goddamn conversation. Tamar feels like she don't have nothing to apologize for. So, um, she don't want to keep on arguing. Keep None of them want to keep on going, living the past, and doing all this bullshit. But the mama feels like these girls need to talk. They need to work it out because the mama getting ready to have surgery. And she just want her girls to get along. So I get that. And um, so they end up having this girls weekend just to get back in their good graces or whatever. But before the weekend happened, like I said, Tra- Trina tells Tawanda, don't say nothing about me and engagement. She said, oh, I won't, I won't, I won't. But then when Tra- Tamar, all these damn teeth, Tamar and Tony was out dinner and they were sitting there talking and you know having a good time or whatever and then somehow something came up about them getting together and all that kind of stuff and when they were talking to Tawanda on the phone Tawanda tells them oh y'all need to talk to Tracy I mean Trina and I'm sitting there like really really this is how shit gets started this is how shit keeps going I was not here for that Tawanda Tawanda's messy as fuck I mean, but I don't understand why they keep telling her stuff when she's always been like this since the first season. Um, but she tells them, oh, y'all need to talk to Trina. Y'all need to talk to Trina. I'm not going to tell y'all what, but I'm just saying y'all need to talk to Trina and ask her what's going on between her and Gabe. And then her excuse is, oh, well, they don't want her to say it on the, in the um, they don't want to hear about it in the tabloids, and then she didn't tell them. And we'll, we'll, but I'm like, well, you should have told your sister that. When she told you don't say nothing. All that to me was messy as hell. Knowing y'all don't get along. I felt I was all kind of wrong. All kind of wrong. And then if I missed something. Try to get to the game. I'm a heart. Whatever. Because I like these girls. Um, so. They all go. Have a little weekend. And they cool. They chilling. They go to eat. Everybody having a good time. Then Tamar acts. Uh, Trina, what's wrong with her because she looks sad or whatever. And um, she ended up, because she was a, she didn't want to tell him, but here come Tawanda over here talking and stuff. And so she didn't have no choice but to tell them that she was getting divorced. Of course, Tamar is going to go in and tell her all her feelings. And then here come shady ass Tony telling her her feelings about it. And that's what she didn't want to hear, so that's what she didn't want to tell her sister. But then in the same token, she was telling them, but not telling them the whole story, and they all caught on to it. But I'm sitting there like, as sisters, yeah, they see you going through something, I'm sorry. They are going to have an excuse about your man. So it's, like I said, if you didn't want them to know, you shouldn't have told Tawanda, and you should have just said, I'm, I'm going through something I don't want to talk about. If they can't respect that, then that's on that. Um, 
But yeah, so, but like I said, she wasn't telling them the whole story and stuff like that. And I kept saying, and so they kept saying, are we going to find out some stuff in the tabloids? And she didn't know what to say. And she just kept saying, it's worse than what y'all think. And I'm saying, I'm like, okay, well, what did he do with you? That's the only thing I kept saying. What the fuck did he do? Was it her? She said, he's trying to take everything. But I'm like, your lawyer told you this happens all the time. He gets down and dirty. So my thing is the only thing I could think of is he and put his hands on this girl. I mean, there's nothing else I can think of. Um, I think that was, oh, they end up going to have a walk with their mama. And, you know, just having a, all of her daughters there, that was a blessing for her. And, you know, just having a real good talk. And then they end up telling, because they was asking her questions. And she didn't want it to be about her. So then... Tracy, I mean, Trina brings up her situation, so that makes her mama wonder what's going on, so she tells her mama what's going on, her mama like, for real this time, everybody's the type of person for real this time, because we are, like, for real this time, um, but, yeah, so her mama just basically giving her advice that this time you're going to have to fight, baby girl, because you know how dirty he is, you're going to have to fight, and, oh, with that whole juggler thing, I was with Tamar. I thought the balls too. I mean, I'm just saying. I did too. Maybe it's our age era. I thought that shit too. Um, other thing I forgot to talk about is Tawanda was going dress shopping because she was going on a date with Andre and I didn't even care about them too because they go back and forth just like Trina and Gabe go back and forth. So I didn't even care. Um, if like I said, if I missed anything, um, talk to me in the comments and when I'll talk to you back. But um it was a cool episode. I liked it. I enjoyed it. It wasn't a real bigger cattiness bull. So I, I really enjoyed this episode and I hope this the rest of this season keep on going like that and not no just drama, drama, drama. Um, I hope it'll be about supporting each other this time. But we and we know it's gonna be some drama. I just I hope it be Everybody ganging up on one person. Everybody just keep are downing a person or not supporting each other as sisters. I don't want to see none of that. I just, like I said, I just hope this really be a good good up um the rest of the season. Um, my my name for all my new subscribers. If you subscribe to me off of this video, my name is Miss Nika. I do everything on social media by the ghetto U T H A N I T H E. Subscribe, share, like, all that good stuff. Talk to me. I will talk to you back. I'm all about support. So I will talk to you guys back. Um, and I'll see you in the next video because I will be reviewing the Back to Family Values the rest of the season. I love these ladies and I just want to see them win and get along for a damn thing. Um, yeah. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Peace out.